Hello, sir. Scott from How You Guys. Lovely Hi. to meet you. Nice to meet you. Congratulations on the film. Thank you. Uh, you've been with this for over a year now, since since Cannes. Has the whirlwind kind of... Are you looking forward to a break? <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah, all no, this? it's... Um, I mean, I think it's great that the, that the film has kind of uh, got this much attention. I, it will hopefully mean more people will see it. Yeah. Jonathan's very particular about his films. You know, he's very precise, takes his time, everything else. When he first kind of talked to you about the idea, do you think it was something that he could pull off? Because people I spoke to have said maybe not the idea wasn't quite there and as he's went on he's found the film that he wanted to make it's always like that with John I've worked with John for a very long time and you know the process of filmmaking is uh, for John particularly is is a journey really yeah. it's almost a sculptural kind of form really uh, and that suits us both very well actually um, we discover the film we're making as we make it um, when he first mentioned it to me I distinctly remember being incredibly weighed down by the idea of it. I just didn't um, didn't relish the idea of getting this close to those people. Um, and I think as a designer you have to inhabit the people to understand the environment that you're creating. So yes, it was with a very heavy sort of shoulder, it felt like sandbags on my back a bit. Um, and I couldn't see where the light was. It all seemed so terribly dark. Um, and as we got into the process, it, it did it, it did start to kind of take shape uh, towards, I mean, it's an ongoing, I mean, I think there were even things happening, there were definitely some development things after Cannes, you know, so even Cannes was a sort of uh, a test, you yeah. know. Yeah. Uh, so, you know, it's, it, I, th I think if we hadn't had to stop, we'd still be doing it. Yeah. You know. What was it, I mean, the experience for me in the cinema and for a lot of people in the cinema was quite overwhelming. When you guys saw it for the first time, did you, like you say, you're still kind of tweaking it here and there, but was the experience kind of overwhelming for you? Could you believe what yeah, I mean, the finished me, product the, was? The, I mean, I knew, I knew what we'd filmed so intimately. Um, and obviously with that many cameras running for that much time, you, you don't use very much of it in reality. And in terms of proportion of what you, what you harvest, you know. Um, but when we were even making it, I was really clear, really, um, well, we both were, we all were, just struck by, well, imagine when you can hear it. Because obviously when we were filming, we didn't have the sound. The sound was being gathered and being harvested, but we weren't hearing that sound when we were filming it. So I was really pleased to see that come together. And that came quite late, you know, I think I first saw a cut of that maybe, I don't know, maybe six weeks before can. You know. And uh, just a final question, I mean, it seems to be this year, for the first time in a few years, where theatrical and cinema is slowly coming back to where maybe it was, you know, five, ten years ago. How important was it for you guys that the film was shown in cinemas? Because you could have quite easily gone down a streaming route. But for all that endeavour and for what the film is, you must have been so delighted that it was going to get a cinema release. Yes, I mean, that's cuts to, you know, partly why it's so thrilling to be involved in, in, in you know, in, in all of this. Uh, I mean, essentially, I, I think it's fair to say Zone of Interest isn't a film some ways yeah. um, it, you witness something you 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 experience something and I think you can only really do that in a cinema so I think it's really crucial out of the theatrical release yeah. Fantastic. I wish all the best and I thank you so thank much for your time pleasure talking to you thank you so much ladies and gentlemen you're watching hey you guys hey you guys <laughs> hey you guys hey that's what they all say hey you guys hey you guys